Krakow, Poland, a city known for its rich history, vibrant culture, and picturesque parks. But did you know that it's also home to a passionate tennis community? Hi, I'm Eric Claggett with Primal Tennis, and let's explore the vibrant tennis community in Krakow, Poland. It starts with one thing. I don't know why. It doesn't even matter how hard you try. Keep that in mind. I'm designed this product to explain in due time. All I know, time is a valuable thing. Watch it fly by as the pendulum swings. Watch it count down to the end of the day. The clock takes life away. It's so unreal. Didn't look out below. Watch the time go right out the window. Trying to hold on. Didn't even know or wasted it all just to watch it. Now sometimes it can be quite intimidating and even a little bit lonely when I arrive to a new city and don't know a single person. And that's why I'm so grateful for tennis where there's just a tribe of people waiting for you to become one of. And by the way, I learned this recently but it's really stuck with me. And that's that courage is not the absence of fear, it's feeling the fear and doing it anyways. And to me that means stepping out of my comfort zone and realizing that it's okay to have fear with things. And one of the beautiful things about tennis for me is that it opens an entire world of people to you just by traveling with your tennis rackets. You can see a whole new city through a completely different lens. Meeting locals, meeting other travelers, and making new friends. And Krakow has a Facebook community where if you're looking to play tennis here, that's the best place to start. And that's where I met Sheen, Mutu, Damla, as well as locals Jurek, Peter, Swavik, and Leo. And fortunately, Krakow was a very easy city to play tennis in. And I'm not just saying that. I remember playing tennis in Medellin, Colombia, and Buenos Aires, Argentina. For example, where there's just a lot more logistics and you really need to learn Spanish if you want to be able to communicate. But it's not just about the game. Tennis in Krakow for me has become about building relationships and creating lasting memories. The camaraderie among players is truly remarkable with laughter and friendship being just as important as the final score. By the way guys, highlighting local tennis communities around the world is a big job, but it's a job that I'm dedicated to doing. So I hope if this video has been helpful to you, you will hit the like button so it will spread to more people and subscribe to the channel so I can continue to do the job. A lot of people ask me, you know, why Krakow, Poland to be your first city in Europe? And the answer is pretty simple. You know, I worked at LTP in Charleston for a number of years and I got to see a lot of awesome Polish tennis players up close. Players like Magda Lynette, Magdalena Frank, Katarzyna Kava, and you know, of course, you've got some of the top players in the world like Iga Spiontek and Hubert Hercox, players that I really admire. And I'm sorry if my pronunciation on those names is a little bit off, you know, I'm still kind of struggling with the Polish language, but now let's check out some of my best points here in Krakow. And guys, please comment in the comment section, ask questions, give additional insights. You know, there's some things I didn't really learn about, like the Tennis for You app, and there's also a city membership called Multisport, where if you're staying here long term, you can play tennis in many places, use swimming pools, gyms, yoga classes, you name it. 
uh, where all these businesses accept that card and give you a nice discount. So whether you're a tennis enthusiast or just looking to try something new, I encourage you guys to come check out the vibrant tennis community here in Krakow, Poland. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll also be making a video about my favorite places to play, favorite tennis clubs to play here in Krakow, Poland. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel to see more awesome new content in the future.